Does anyone else find me funny? I'm like non-existent on YouTube. My highest video has over 13,000 views. My lowest has like 45, okay? Does anybody like my humor? I can't ask you to su subscribe because no one watches. I can't ask you to comment because then people will say like, she's a reptile. Or they'll be like, I love your hair. Thank you, thank you. Please comment if you want. Please subscribe. But I watch my videos and I'm my biggest fan. I'm always laughing. On the Exena Fox channel, we are random. We go from super basic, okay, to super sexy, to really nerdy, to really weird, real quick. Take two, that's what I'm talking about. So this is my calico cat hurting from the heat exhaustion. No, I'm just kidding. I wet her down. She is a calico angora in an apartment with no air conditioning and just some really big fans. You have to wet your cat down every day, brush her. I'm going to make a video about how I take care of this poor beast. Literally just hold your calico angora under the fan and wet her down, wash her. This is my cactus plant is grumpy over there because it's not sunny. Everybody's hurting in this heat. My cactus friend. She is a California fairy cactus, I think it's called, from CVS. It's not a game, it's a red It's a big day today, going to Walmart, so you're going to start day out uh, with some coffee. Be careful. <laughs> Forty bucks and they're all for little kitties. Well, now that we've started a forest fire, yeah, no, just kidding. You can smell them. Save room for the real hot cake because that's the best and I can tell you no one eats cake when I make it I'm the only one pretty much Bass doesn't like strawberry cake so I'm like more for me I can eat this cake in four days 
You're probably wondering what to do if you haven't grown up and you want to eat the cake batter. No, we don't need to be unintelligent and eat the raw egg. We can do this instead because this is not organic. It's not okay. This is not a kid's channel, so I'm warning you. Please don't take my bad advice too seriously. But for me, the recommended advice of the dose of cake batter, cake mix with uh, water, is just eat it until your stomach hurts. But here on the Xena Fox channel, we don't waste an ounce of cake. That's not good. So this is the cake batter with the egg. It's overflowing. What do you do with the rest? And there you have it, the perfect treat so that you're children or those that haven't grown up yet do not have to eat the raw egg. Making this bad boy cake again, trying to gain some weight. It is like past 11 p.m. right now so it's definitely going to help me gain weight. I prefer to cook with glass over metal. I mean, I don't know the components inside of metal, but I know that I definitely do not approve of cooking with foil because the foil gets into your food. Yeah, make sure to sniff that cake batter like crazy because it smells really good. So that's almost one fourth of the cake. Probably gonna eat more than that, aren't we, Mr. Bunny? Trying to gain weight past midnight, feeling bougie with the cake. Or hair dye. I have a hair dye problem. It doesn't fall out. It's not thinned out because I've cut it so much. I'm always cutting my hair with professional hair cutting scissors. I do it myself when it's wet because you get a more precise cut and I do a blunt cut straight across. You never want to cut like up into the hair. That will layer your hair Layers are not good for thickness. I do have layers. My hair goes to like above my ear on so many parts so that I'm really excited for when that grows out and it's even thicker. You can only... Okay, so for hair dye, I had green and blue hair. Like, I had to upkeep this probably five times and that's why I gave up. My hair is so porous, it won't hold color perfectly. If you have really porous hair from coloring and stripping and coloring and stripping so much over the years. I started coloring my hair when I was like... 13. It was still washing out because what I should have done if I really wanted to keep that look forever without the use of hair dye I would have gotten, Ion makes a pigments brand, it's called, where it is a color depositing conditioner. Or is it a shampoo? No, it's a hair dye conditioner. And then there's another one that you get at Ulta. Ulta also makes a hair dye shampoo. nearly my whole life is I'm looking at these celebrities like Emily Browning I'm looking at these celebrities my whole life trying to do what the DC universe is doing or whatever or just the hottest thing on TV so I'm looking at like Emily Browning and Sucker Punch thinking oh it's such an amazing doll look I'm gonna try that only to have it make me look washed out because of my high-end Chilean side, which I do love. That's why I should grow up and settle down for like the Megan Fox type look, the vampire look, right? So I mean, even right now I have what they call the e-girl hair, such a cute term for the new age like seeing kid emo kid thing whatever it is I was a scene kid growing up and that was a little funny walking around overdosing on hairspray 
and just like it I wouldn't do it again I would highly not recommend it so I have platinum bangs right now I'm probably always gonna keep this bang look I definitely fell into one of the biggest hair trends right now out there other than like the pastels and you have so many types of rainbow hair nowadays I do know the techniques for doing it all it's really fun you can have like pinwheel iridescent hair imagine I guess like lighter tone ash hair and then put little rainbow like a little here go down a little bit make it patchy looking and have it look like you are a rainbow like it's randomly hitting your head it's not an even hair dye job then you can have like opal hair that's super cute you think of the color spectrum there are an endless amount of shades within the color so with like blonde hair you can drop it down so many levels it gives you an endless amount of blonde type hair and then do that for every single color and then make it pastel like dark pastel light neon bright neon it's just crazy so yes I've done it all I'm just gonna see if I can name these all so then you have like no never mind never mind rainbow hair we do that in another video <laughs> so I was going for this beautiful medium ash brown level 5 so I was going for this beautiful medium ash brown level 5a and that was not right at all I will insert the clip here of what I just filmed of the back of my head in the bathroom <laughs> I have so many of those clips I can make a super long video of just the back of my head so this ash brown turned dark blonde and it doesn't look good and that's why I no, no I'm not like freaking out with hair dye I'm just abusing it because my hair doesn't fall out it's super healthy we'll have to cut it again second haircut this week but oh well I will grow it starting tomorrow and I'm just gonna do ash black with another drugstore product the Revlon soft black I love it doesn't have ammonia in it that's a creepy coincidence with the words how they're so similar in the English language ammonia and pneumonia I'm not gonna use it no 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 you sound like the word pneumonia and I ain't gonna use you you gonna make me sick so I, I use ammonia free hair dye the technical term is hair color. This is the bathroom of Exena Fox. Welcome to my office. I work 9 to 5 here. No, you can't see. It's dirty. We have to clean. As you can tell, we need to clean. Bash had a fresh haircut today. Joker hair. This is the Ion Color Brilliant Sky Blue. I'm using, I've never had blue hair in my whole life. Okay, we had an accident with the hair dye. So this is my shirt of the day. And if you're wondering what I even look like, no, my hair is not blonde. That would be busted. I make the worst blonde ever. Mountain Dew. Wow, it's picking up so golden. I feel like I color my hair as much as Stella Chini or Lindsay Lohan used to. I really hate light colored hair on me, so I'm really hoping for like that bright cerulean. Two packages of this one and only argan oil bleach will get you two ounces of the bleach powder and then four ounces of the developer so that's like six ounces I'm working with. That's enough for my short hair.
but seriously, look how amazing this would have been. I'm really tired right now. It does show in your eyes. So, whenever I do my hair color, I do it with some water. I don't know if this is organic. Purified reverse osmosis. My mom has that filter system for her well at home. I approve of this message. I prefer, for the best water brand, the organic nature's place and nature's promise. I add a little water into my hair color as well. I just rinse the bowl so it's not dusty and I add like that much, just a drop to revive it. Don't use sink water. I am so against city water. Oh my god, I have never used city water in my whole life, thankfully. Besides the times that I would go to a friend's house, I didn't start using city water until 2018. They purify it with chlorine, so you're now drinking chlorine. Chlorine and bleach right there. Get that at the view finder. So, you're now bathing in chlorine and drinking chlorine every day. I don't know the percentage that is in the city water, but I just know that purified well water is so much healthier. It's organic. You do need, like, the reverse osmosis system will remove, like, parasites or whatever. I mean, you, you need to keep a well very clean. I feel very lucky that I've been able to bathe like with organic water. I don't take health and spirituality and all that stuff for granted. Well, I do, but you know, I'm educated in it. So I don't play really, really loud music. I shouldn't when I dye my hair because you don't want to have like a headache you want to do it in a very ventilated area. You want to have water. Feel hydrated on your face. That's why I also do not wear eye makeup because I care way more about the internal beauty showing on the outside rather than just like covering up with some stupid cream that is going to give me zits and not even look good after an hour of sweating. So I'm sorry, your caking and baking needs to stop. You're looking silly. You're looking like you stuck a pie in your face, okay, wash it off, it takes like, what, half an hour for your caking and baking, and then to wash off, you just spent the whole day putting it on and take it off. So I'd rather spend my whole day running my face under the most freezing cold water ever to have it tighten up my face on top of the disport that I've gotten, on top of like the creams I use, and just feeling fresh and healthy rather than that. And I still look like a doll, look at that, because all I did is put on this lipstick and now I'm ballin'. But I'm definitely the biggest troll ever when I take off the lipstick. So, no, 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 you can't see. I'm gonna hide that. And I'm very excited for liposuction to fat lip augmentation for lifelong results. Bash is always wiling when we're getting ready because he's like, you're taking so long always. So, just imagine with how long I already take to purify myself and like get ready and feel good going out, especially in a super hot summer day. And now you want me to sit there for half an hour like these other women caking and baking. Nah, -uh, we ain't gonna go anywhere if I do that. And if I can just make one more offensive joke about this caking and baking makeup technique, your highlight sucks. You've now just done nothing besides turn yourself into some attractive flower. I really hope that I don't have all the drag queens and like makeup guru dolls come after me because good for you, you've caked on your face. And my face, like, it has a natural highlight anyway, you know? Even when I wash my face, okay, so I burn my face under hot water, not really but just to open the pores and then like scratch the dead skin off like any reptile they shed their skin well in case you humans didn't know we shed our skin too and a good way to get your dead skin 
what is it, Dead Sea Minerals, the Middle Eastern brand, but I don't use that. I do really like it though, it's really cool. Just a natural way to get your dead skin off is under water, you wet your skin and then you scratch it with your nail. And now you have this nasty, large, large amount of dead skin from your whole body that you have to do every day. And if it's hot out, multiple times a day you have to scratch, especially your face. So okay, with your cheeks you go up so that you don't wrinkle. And yeah, so I wash my face and then like, you know, there's no need to add stuff to it. But you can have a cute highlight, like forgive the sweat I have now, about to color my hair and then shower. But so I like, I always have this natural highlight anyway. I don't need to be flower. So as usual, I have my Cindy Lou Who hair ready to dye the hair with like the e-girl bangs. Feeling a little fresh, feeling a little freaked about this. But this is my favorite hair color. That awkward moment when you play your song over and over because YouTube is completely staged in order to make a video good. So yeah, it's a super spiritual thing for me to want to look like undead. Jennifer's body type, not only from the doppelganger science behind it, from thinking that's how I look the sexiest. But yeah, I'm gonna hype it up. Megan Margot just did her hair back to black, and like I do know I should grow up with it. For modeling, it's a really exotic look. And even though I'm mainly light skin size, like Finnish, French, British, Irish, many more because I need a DNA test, I love my Chilean side. I think I got a little Italian in there. Alright, so we're going to clean these products and then let's hit the black. Mix it up, let it sit for two minutes so that all the chemicals rise up and out. I think it's called oxidizing. I don't know how to say that word, so I'm really going to look it up. But yeah, so I put it in this open container because I want my hair dye to breathe, just like me, in the ventilated room. Did the eyebrows, got some Billy Eilish style reverse ombre. I see you. I see how you did that after I did that. This is my haircut. Look fresh, feel fresh every day. Working with these bougie Euronex Sally's Beauty Supply hair extensions. Just look at this like multi reverse ombre. So I have way more sets than these, but these look pretty cool. Okay, so my loving mom always tries to go out of the way for me. She just got me Moe's. This is what I get. I get the rice ball with extra kinds of both of the rice. No, Molly, you can't have this. I get tofu, mushrooms, and then chipotle southwest drizzled on, extra queso, make your own fajitas, and the best hot sauce ever. And this is how I have to eat the whole time, getting the little girl next to me to not eat my food. salad life plus this Mountain Dew. So for $17 about you can get at Price Chopper this really nice looking vegetable pack and it comes with ranch and like a spicy Mexican sauce. I'm drinking this core perfectly balanced pH purified water. I do not approve of this packaging because 
it didn't even have like the safety seal on it so I'll never be buying this again for herpes safety of course and for corona safety can't forget the non-organic milk yeah I'm like advertising this stuff really nice tonight we have a blueberry coffee colada with three pumps Dunkin bagel with butter frozen coffee three pumps blueberry